The first of today's classic trials is the Dante Stakes. It's a 10 furlong group two for three year old Colts. It's a Derby trial for next weekend. At the top, we've got Carnelian Great for David Robertson. Echo Solo for Craig Allen. Fear the Man, Michael Scala. Mystic Guide, Dan Hughes. Rocksteady, Martin Bingham. Star of Surprendra for Paul Rhodes. Tamarillo Files, Rod McClure. And Crask End Ocean for Darren Thompson. So eight then facing the starter in this one. And. All ready they go, and away they go, and it's a really level break, although Rocksteady was maybe a little bit slow. Also, Mystic God was held up on the break, but it's Echo Solo who's the early leader, but now being impressed by Star of Sapendra, and that one looks like he wants to try and get across the defence, but being held out at the moment by Tamarillo Files. Crask End Ocean is also close up, and now Star of Sapendra has managed to get across to a more inside position, but Echo Solo's got the rail, and Star of Sependra, in fact, is still wide, didn't get across at all, didn't have the pace to get in front of Tamarillo Files. Crask End Ocean and Cornelian Great, and next looking to the back, Rocksteady still just the back marker with Fear the Man on his inside and Mystic Guide on his outside, but six lengths separates the field at this point as they come towards the sixth furlong mark, and it's Echo Solo who leads by two lengths to Crask End Ocean in second. On the inside of that one is Carnelian Great, on the outside the Great Tamarillo Files, on the outside of that one is Suprend. Star of Supreme, Mystic Guide is wider still. The back two are Fear the Man who's got the run and will need a dream split. So too will Rocksteady, but it's Echo Solo who leads by two lengths to Crask End Ocean in second. Carney Lindgrate on the inside is third. Star of Surprender is four. And then Tamarillo Files, Fear the Man, Rocksteady trying to get going. Mystic Guide still at the back, but it's Echo Solo who's in the lead at the moment. Being chased by Crask End Ocean and Carnelian Great. Star of Sependra is taking his time to get going, but he's now going into overdrive up the centre of the track. Tamarillo Files, Mystic Guide, Fear the Man, Rocksteady is now looking a little bit outpaced, but it's Echo Solo who's still in front by two as they come past the two furlong pole. Then it's Echo Solo in front. Star of Sependra is trying to close. Crask End Ocean is third. Mystic Guide four. And then Carnelian Great, Fear the Man, Rocksteady and Tamarillo Files, but it's Echo Solo still. Echo Solo into the final furlong, led all the way so far still leads by a length and a half, Star of Sependra is trying to close but Echo Solo is holding him at the moment and Echo Solo looks to be holding this one and up towards the line now a last launch by Sependra of Sependra and it was very close in the end Star of Sependra just got a last minute burst and may have got up to take it but the angle's deceptive Echo Solo Ooh, that's going to be close that's going to be close that one and it's a short head win for Star of Surprendra for Paul Rhodes. So Echo Solo second for Craig Allen. Mystic Guide for Dan Hughes third. Crask End Ocean for Darren Thompson fourth. And Fear the Man for Michael Scott a fifth there. Uh, taking into account the time it took for Star of, Suspend Star of Surprendra to get going. I would suggest that an extra two furls at Epsom next week might well be in that one's favour. So that could be a... Bit of a decent derby trial, even though it only won by a short head.